What would you do if you sat next to a mom and her kids and she can only afford one meal? Doesn't this look delicious? Here's one for you. Thank you very much. One for you. Thank you. One for me and an extra slice for my birthday boy. Thanks, Mom. But why do we always have to share one plate of food? Can't we get some more? I'm sorry. This is all I can afford. And that has to be one of the most heartbreaking things as a parent. Have to tell your children. That's all we can afford. We need to ration our food here in this public restaurant in front of everyone. Right, welcome to Reaction Time, everyone. If you're new to the channel, my name is Tall Fishman, and we're going to look at another public social experiment from the famous show, What Would You Do? We saw the public react to spoiled kids. Mom fat shaming her daughter. Teacher hitting on her student. And now we're watching the mom who can't afford more than a single meal. Let's see what people say and think about this scenario. Today, we're in Louisiana. Louisiana, a state with one of the highest percentages of people living below the poverty line. Can I just point out, I want you guys to comment down below if this ever happened to you. If your parents had to ration to a point where you guys actually went out to a restaurant, you had to all split a single meal. Struggling to make ends meet. But mom, it's his birthday. How about you can take my slice of case for you? Oh, no. Are you hungry too? I'm okay. Eat up. No, she's lying. She's hungry and she's just saying that. So she protects and hides you from the real truth. And our mom has been saving up to treat her kids to a birthday meal. Hey guys, are you ready to order? Yes. One quesadilla? One quesadilla and for the kids? Um, that's for all of us. Thank you. When our daughter begins to badmouth the budget. I don't want to split my meal. It's not fair. And the way this was set up, this is a single mother. They're all actors, obviously, to incite a public reaction and to see what people think. This is all mommy can afford right now, okay? I don't want to split my meal. They listen discreetly from their table. If we had to split the quesadilla, can we at least get cake? Yeah. No, honey. It's a treat enough that we're out here together for your brother's birthday, okay? Okay. Is anyone going to offer to buy two more meals for this family? But when our kids step away... Oh, here we go. Something's happening here. Something's happening. This, this mother's is so heart is too cool that she waited till the kids left. Not to share. Don't cry, sweetie. Don't cry. Aww. They don't understand. I'm gonna pay for y'all dinner, okay? I know these are actors, but this is a real public reaction, though. This is a stranger at a restaurant comforting the mother. Wow, that one got me deep quick. Woo! That hit me right in the feels. Right here. I'm good. All right. <clears throat> you order up dinner. You let them order their food. You buy them the cake they want. You act like it was good, okay? This is amazing. This is amazing. I want to tell my kids what you did. No. Like, you let it be you. So you just put a smile back on your face before they come out? Order your dinner? You eat. You eat. This was not supposed to hit me like this, all right? Not this quick. It's literally the first stranger to come up to her. She's so humble. This is what, honestly, the news should report. And when our kids learn the good news. You guys, I decided we need the quesadilla and the cake. That's so good! Yay! Their smiles are the only thanks this mother and daughter need. Thank you so much, Mom. They're so yes. sweet. Oh, my God. Begin to flow. Hello there. Hi. This is part of a TV show called What Would You Do? Oh, good heavens. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god, oh, it was a setup. <laughs> you didn't want her to tell the kids. No, because it wasn't, mom needed to feel special that she was doing it for her children. It makes me feel good to have made them feel good. Have you been through some tough times? We lived through Katrina. <laughs> so yes, we lost everything. We lost our home and we have people who helped us tremendously people give to you you give back to people that is so true the woman and her daughter these are miracle workers i just feel like there's so many good people with such big hearts i do stuff like this in honors of this video guys i'm actually donating feeding america and this is such a perfect video that can lead to such a good cause to help people struggle to afford food and the proceeds of this video is going to be donated as well so all i ask for you guys is to leave a like and if you guys want to spend a dollar or two you don't have to but anything can help go to the link in the description help end hunger today food and water is the most essential i'm going to be donating a thousand dollars says your incredible act of generosity will have a profound effect on someone's life your gift today will help us provide 10,000 meals to families in need and as you can see this is a confirmation it just feels so good when people help others this man wastes no time helping our hungry family it's tough times right now for me okay we just want to have our own quesadilla he assures them that that's no problem at all 
Sir, sir, you don't have to do that. No, 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 it's okay. I'm telling you, everybody needs help at some point in time. I've been there. And he even adds wow. one more wow. item to the tab. It's your birthday? Yeah, yes, yeah, my birthday. Give him some cake. <laughs> Give the boys some cake. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Woo! Wow, these are such kind-hearted people. And I completely agree with him when he said, everybody needs help at some point in life. Some people just go through bad periods of time and they don't have anyone that can help them. An average guy helping his family on his birthday. We eager to lend a hand. I've been there, my mom was a single mom. It was just me and her for uh, 14 years. So when you saw this little boy, you saw yourself. Mm -hmm. Oh man. What did you want him to know? That there is kindness in this world still. Damn it, y'all got me crying. And as it turns out, we're not the only ones moved by his kindness. Well, I was thinking about paying for his meal. For his meal? Yeah, like paying it forward because like he paid for theirs, so I was gonna pay for his. I was just thinking about it. Did you guys hear that? It makes me think like kindness has such a big domino effect. One person does something good for and then another person wants to do something good for that person. This next diner tries to help our kids see things through a different perspective. We have to share one plate as a family. Some people do that. Like when you order pizza, you know, you order pizza and everybody takes a piece, you know, share. She suggests being thankful for what they have. But I'm so hungry after this little bit. Would you see what you got and be happy you got it? <laughs> but when her mother is back, they feel inclined to make a cash contribution. I want to give you this for his birthday. You just gave me a $20 bill. Ma'am, you don't have to do that. You don't have, why are you doing this? Just because. Thank you so much. I feel like with everything that happened this year and so many people are struggling now, it just breaks my heart. And then seeing this, this is an older video, but seeing this just kind of makes me tear up. Times are really tough right now, you know? I understand. I've been there. When times are tough, you gotta do what you can do. Well, thank you. You're welcome. That's so sweet, guys. I want to hear your experience. Let me know if you guys ever had to go through stuff like this. When I was younger and my parents, we moved a lot. And the only time we'd actually go to a restaurant was when it was a special event, like a birthday. We wouldn't share one meal like this family. Seeing people that have it so hard, you know, there's so many people like this. It just kind of hurts. You really have to split it up. You could take mine, okay? You can have mommy's piece. And this woman at the neighboring table can't help but listen to our family's situation. What about the cake? It's my birthday. Drayton, I can't get a cake, okay? I can't afford it, okay? But when our mother seems overwhelmed by the pressure... Mommy's going to the back. I'll be right back. This fellow mom just can't remain quiet. We turn up Erica's mic. Something's wrong, and I'm very upset for you. And I don't know what it is, and it's not my business, but I love you. Oh, shoot. These are strangers. That's what's insane. I just don't see stuff like this happen that often. The fact that this had hidden cameras and you could actually record this, and seeing and hearing people do stuff like this for others that they don't even know is crazy. It's my son's birthday, and I just wish I could do a lot more. And like, that's all I can afford. She leads her mom back to the table and makes a considerate donation. She's going into her purse. Oh man, this is a hundred dollars. A hundred dollars? How much is Go have a birthday for you, baby. Thank you so much. You just pray for me and I'm gonna pray for you. And one day you're gonna pay it forward and you go have a good birthday with your baby. All right, I'm embarrassed, literally tearing up on camera. This just, just hit your emotions a little differently. I know it does for me. Not everyone is gonna feel the same way, but this feels very sentimental. Hi ma'am, how are you? I'm Jack and Giannis. <laughs> yes. It's what would you do? You went to go look for her in the ladies room. Uh-huh. It hurts to see other people suffer. Even if you don't know them, even if... God made us all. For her to hurt, hurt me. It's very touching. Love one another. Pretty simple. Very simple. Okay, I think I'm done here. If you guys enjoyed the message, if you guys enjoyed seeing these acts of kindness, leave a huge thumbs up. And if you guys want to help a family, then link is in the description. Anything can help. Even if you go donate your time, it will still help. And I feel very excited to just use my voice and hopefully make a positive out of these videos that will maybe impact more lives. So guys, that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any other acts of kindness like this or any other videos you want me to look at, make sure to send it to me on Instagram. All my socials are going to be right here. I love you guys. I'll see you guys next time. Have a great one. Peace out.